Hi everyone and welcome to my place. I've been playing around here all day, mucking around with lotions and potions, trying to come up with an alternative to the first solid perfume I made. Now this is a little bit, well I don't know, you might have these ingredients, I'm not sure. But into a little jar, put some beeswax, now that's 15 grams, and with that add 15 grams of lanolin. Now I really, I think I really like this recipe best of both of the recipes because even though it's a wee bit sticky at this stage, you know, this is a bit sticky doing this, when it goes onto the skin, it's a little bit smoother and it's a little bit more pliable or creamier so that you can add more things, you can do more things to it instead of it being hard up. So that, one moment, my double boiler, hold on, here's my little double boiler thing happening here. I'll take that out because I've, that's already melted. Put that in and it takes about five minutes to melt down. Don't go away and do something else. I'll put the washing out, just keep an eye on it. You need to let that cool down and then into that I add whatever essential oils you want. So I'm going to put in about 2.5, yeah, 2.5 mils of musk because that's what I feel like, but rose is equally beautiful in this. Let's not waste that little drop, put that drop there. And then give that a wee stir up, a wee blend. Oh, that is delicious. And hopefully this all fits into here. Yes, it does. My calculations work. I do love it when they work out. Let that set, put a label on it. And with my little perfume, um, locket that I wear. I just, oh look, I've done it again. I've lost my pin, but never mind. You just pop that out and then use a knife to scoop a bit out of there, put it into there, close it up, wear it, and when you need perfume, in a hurry, you have got it. I have a tip before I go. When it comes to cleaning out your jar, do not put it into the sink because what will happen is that wax could clog up the works. So this is what I do. I put boiling hot water into here and gently, gently carry that outside and tip it on the garden or put it into the compost, and which I'll do right now, so I'll be back in a minute. I'm back, I'm back. So once you've done that, just use a handy towel while it's still really, really hot. Get that into there. Oh, it is hot, 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 hot. You could use toilet paper, but I'm using a handy towel. Put that into there and give that a good clean out. You might have to do it two or three times, but that, and that jar is what I use for doing my lotions and potions. So that's, and then before I used it again, I just put boiling water in it, do the same process again, so that I know that that is clean and sterile and ready to go. Tip from me, enjoy. And just one more tip, see these? Put them in the compost bucket, they'll all just add to the richness of your compost. That's it until I see you again another day. Mm -hmm.